Um, hi, brothers and sisters in Christ. I wanted to make this video to talk about some scientific facts found in the Bible. Um, first of all, the Bible has not been changed like some Muslims claim. We have thousands upon thousands of ancient manuscripts that we can verify the current Bible that we have right now. The most famous being the Dead Sea Scrolls, which date back from 250 BC to 68 AD. Um, these facts that I will, uh, these facts will prove to you that the Bible is credible scientifically it makes complete sense and is the word of god so some people claim that the bible is just some book written by nomadic people thousands of years ago and trust me it's the bible was not just written by some people thousands of years ago it's it's divinely inspired it was written through prophets and the scientific facts i'm going to be talking about in this video if if it was not for divine intervention, the nomadic people, as some people um, like to call the ancient Hebrews, they would not have known these. So, at the time of writing the scriptures, science told a complete different story and most of the scientific facts found in the Bible were proven to be true just in the past few hundred years. This, me this means that the Bible was literally thousands of years ahead of its time. Um, in this video, I will talk about si five scientific facts in the Bible, and and I also have the facts in the in the picture of the video, as you can already tell. And I'll be talking about it more in depth. So the the facts listed in the picture of this video, that's that's I'm going to be going into in depth in the video. First, first of all, in Jeremiah thirty three twenty two, this was written two thousand five hundred years ago. It says, as the host of heaven cannot be numbered, neither the sand of the sea measured. So host of heaven, that's a biblical term for stars. This code is saying there are billions of stars. When this was written, there were only 1100 observable stars in the universe. Now we know that there are billions of billions of stars. So the Bible said this 2500 years ago. It's fascinating. Next, Job 26.7. This was written 3,500 years ago. It says, He stretches out the north over the empty space and hangs the earth upon nothing. So 3,500 years ago, the, the scriptures claimed that the earth fr fr freely float, floats in space. Back then, the scientists of the time thought that the... Not just scientists, the general, the, the general consensus was that the earth sat on a large animal and every time the animal moved, there was an earthquake. That's what people thought. Thought. Now we know that the Bible, now we know what the Bible told us 3,500 years ago about the earth having free float in space. So it's fascinating. The Bible told us the earth hangs on nothing. That's, it's, wow, it just blows my mind. Uh, next, Isaiah 40, 22. This was written 2,800 years ago. It is he that sits upon the circle of the earth. So the Bible clearly says that the earth has a round shape. Shape. Um, at the time when people believed the earth was flat. This fact is simply mind-blowing. The Bible clearly says the earth is round. I mean, when just think back to when scientists um, agreed that the earth was, it had a spherical shape. That's That was not very long ago. And the Bible said this, what, um, 2,800 years ago. Mind-blowing. Next, Leviticus 17.11, written 3,000 years ago. It says, for the life of the flesh is in the blood. Clearly, the scriptures say that the blood is the source of life. Up until 1200 years ago, um, sick people were bled to get rid of their sickness. That's what people thought. If you make a person bleed, their sickness will be gone. We, not, we, now, know that the, we now know what the Bible said 3000 years ago. And that is the blood is the source of life. Next, Hebrews 11.3, written 2000 years ago. It says, through faith we understand that the worlds were framed by the word of God, so that things which are seen were not made of things which to appear. So this verse claims that creation is made of invisible material. We now know this to be true because we know that the entire creation is, is made up of in invisible elements called atoms. So do you really think humans thousands of years ago could have come up with this knowledge themselves no this was clearly from god and this just proves that the bible is credible it's scientifically accurate and we should trust it so these were just five of the hundreds of scientific facts found in the bible this was this was this is what i wanted to share with you guys hopefully this opened your eyes if you're not a believer and also in the description box of this video i have a message about the the rapture and great tribulation 
please, I, I understand that that message might not save people now, but once the rapture happens, people will remember that message, and if they were not Rap if they were not raptured, they'll remember that message. They'll remember what they read in that message, and they'll wake up. They'll realize what's going on, and they'll turn to God during the time of the great tribulation. So, if you can, if you're gonna print out that message, if you're gonna email it, anything you can to spread the word, I'll, I'll appreciate it. God will appreciate it. God bless you, and all glory to God because all glory belongs to Him.